key. Perfect. Oh, it's got a little Nuka Cola bottle on it and everything. Oh, good. There are things in here. That... Shut up, Nick. I know I'm carrying it. Because he's dead, of course, none of this actually ain't belongs to him anymore. Oops. Nice. It is a really fancy vault. And I broke another one. There we go. That's it. Ooh, swords. Knives. What's that mean? The shovel is used to break ground for the Cardoza Medical Research Center in Venezuela. The funding and management of the construction was overseen by Mr. Ezra Parker. Hello. There's a lot of noise. Hat. Oh my god, it's a pirate hat. I could be a pirate if I wanted to. That's just skulls. And those are books. And that's stuff on the floor. Right. Back to the overseer's office. The detective's life isn't an easy one, but it rarely lacks for excitement. True. God. You have a beautiful, clean, shiny vault to this? Okay. Nothing in here that's gonna kill us. It sounds like something stuck. Uh, obviously, it's terminal. Uh, obviously, your instructions. Vault 118 is designed to test the social interactions between the working class and the ultra-wealthy when under confined conditions. Working in conjunction with staff from the Cliff's Edge Hotel, this vault shall function as a luxury hotel to attract the necessary testing subjects. Upon beginning the test, additional subjects shall be admitted from the local population into a second, much inferior wing of the vault. Okay, so if you didn't know, or if you're new to Fallout, all the vaults were uh, are actually social tests. Um, each vault has something different. Um, each vault is just a whole bunch of different social experiments. So vault 111, which is the vault that you start off in this, um, was to do with cryogenics. So you go in when, when the bombs have fallen, the day the bombs have fallen, you go into cryostasis. Uh, so you basically, if you don't know what that means, it means you get frozen. Um, and then the whole point of that experiment was for you to be woken up when it was clear, when the surface radiation had dissipated and when it was clear enough for you to be unfrozen. Fortunately, something went wrong and you got woke you get woken up um at the time that this all is vault 101 which is in fallout 3 i can't remember what it is exactly but if you look it up um there is actually a list i'll see if i can find it i will put it in the description of the video so you can go in and have a look 
if you really want to um yeah there's actually a page that has a whole list of the vaults and what their testing was for i know there's one vault that was if i'm right it was one man and the rest of the residents were women or it was one woman the rest of them were men there was one vault that was full of weapons um you learn more about that one in fallout new vegas as uh, one that was full of food and no exercise equipment and it was a lot of stuff like that really and if you're watching in stream charlotte's just put the link in chat thank you charlotte overseer's uh play tape progress on construction of the second wing of the vault is completely stalled once the premier area of the vault had been completed, funding seems to have been cut off. My supervisors have informed me that they haven't received payment from Mr. Parker, and vault Tech won't pay out of pocket to continue construction. I've repeatedly approached Ezra about the finances, but he keeps telling me that Mrs. Riggs hasn't transferred the funds. However, when I asked her, Juliana said that she had just given Ezra extra for the gold pain in the room. I've hired an investigator to look for signs of embezzlement in a few weeks. Hmm. We received the activation notice from vault -Tec to begin the test despite the second wing still being incomplete. However, when I attempted to trigger the recruitment protocol for test group B, the system informed me that I'd been locked out. Someone from test group A seems to have overridden the system to prevent the admit admittance of the local population of the island. They've been pounding on the door for days and there is nothing I can do. I can't take this. Oh god, it's been weeks now and I realised today that I've become the test subject. Instead of testing the social interactions between the locals and this group of rich arseholes, it's just me trapped in here with them. They're going to live forever and I have to deal with them for the rest of my life. I can't take it. Oh, you poor sod. It sounds like Ezra was embezzling from his investors. Okay. Something fishy is definitely going on. I do agree with you on that one. Right, what am I meant to be doing? Uh, investigating Santiago, Keith, and Juliana. Protect Let's and go serve. this way. Right. Who are you? Keith. Hello, Detective. How can I help? Did you have questions about the case? Mm, never mind. Never mind. Okay. Just let me... Right. It's not Keith. It's definitely not Keith. Fairly certain of that. Did you... I think she did. Uh, Santiago. My fellow connoisseur of the... Never mind. Never mind. Okay. I think it's Juliana. She is definitely. Hello, detective. All right, let's Did accuse Juliana and see what happens. Ezra was embezzling. There's evidence Ezra was embezzling from his investors. Oh well, I really don't believe that. Mr. Parker wouldn't do such a thing, I'm sure. Uh, accused of murder. I think you're the real murderer. <laughs> That's just silly, detective. Why would I want to kill Mr. Parker? Ezra was embezzling. Ezra was embezzling your money. That's why you killed him and framed Keith. You were so close, detective. Damn it. It's a shame. Oh. I thought I could keep the ruse going a little longer. Oh, well, had to end eventually, I suppose. This doesn't have to end in more violence, detective. Just walk away. I'll leave, 
and you can tell them I escaped. No. Ezra? Ezra? You're alive! Well, congratulations on catching up, detective. Yes, I've been masquerading as Juliana for some time now. What's it going hmm. to be, detective? Join me in getting rich or die defending some outdated ideals? I'd rather die. Um, not a chance. Why kill her? Why did you kill Juliana? I hadn't planned on it, but Juliana figured out what I was doing and had to be dealt with swiftly. I thought I could get a bit more money out of this place before making my escape. Well, how is this going to go down? Uh, not a chance. Not a chance. Your murder spree stops here. Then let us end. Uh, I need to heal. <laughs> Everyone's coming. bag but I'll take it right is everyone done helping me now I found Maxwell. the killer it was Ezra he killed Juliana and took her place to hide his tracks my word I never thought mr. Parker was capable of something like this what happened when you confronted him you saw what happened he's dead he attacked me but it's over now. You helped me kill your him. Your residents are safe. There you are, detective. Payment for your services and a bonus for uncovering such a heinous plot. I don't think we could have done it without you. No, you couldn't. What am I going to do with pre-war money? I need bottle caps. Well, folks, we discovered the killer. Now, we need to get out of here. Right. Quests. Um, retrieve storage drives. That's what's next. Now to find the way out. Security. Poor Max. <laughs> I won't forget my suit. Uh, purely simply because my suit is actually up by the door. So I ah. left it there so that I don't forget it. Yeah, see that my suit's here. I wouldn't leave without my suit. Get out of the way, Maxwell. Come on, Nick, we're going. I've got to go and repair my legs, so. Where is Nick? Clearly, he's not coming with us. Right, we'll meet him upstairs then. Oh, there he is. Uh, before I do that... Just hold on to that for now.
Okay, now I need to remember the way out. I think it's night time. Yeah, so I'm gonna go up, I'm gonna fast travel out. Good lord, it's such a long way down there. Problem is, is I can't fast travel from this location. There we go, right outside. Map. Oops. To the Commonwealth. Let's go. And I think I have some armor. Back at. No, not armor. Weapons back at um, thingy of oh, what's it called sanctuary god look at that car it's bright green and windowless and seatbeltless Okay. The institute is gone. I guess I'm glad about that. But you just killed everyone. There wasn't any. Preston, I swear I will kill you. Left leg, repair. Right leg. Repair. Uh, I can't. Oh, what am I missing for that? Oh, aluminium. Surprise, surprise. Right, that's fine. The flag is fine. You need a minute. Uh, arm to do with repairing. But now I can't repair anything else. Yeah, so I'm just short of aluminium now. Yeah, so I'm just short of aluminium now. Why? Another day in the Commonwealth. There we go. What helmet have I got? Oh, I've got the T60. Right, let's have a look. See what I've got. Oh, no, not workshop. Weapons. Of course I don't. I have no melee weapons whatsoever. That's not good. Oops. Wrong button. There we go. So if you didn't know, um, I've got the jetpack on the back of my power armor. Be quiet, Nick. We're not doing this again. So I need to go back to Far Harbor. And it's raining. Right now, I need to find... What's his face? Because I need to talk to him. Right, um... Data. Howard Dunbar. 